So he's not summarizing. He's not summarizing why. Uh, 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 this is a new video, second video um, um, about you know uh, my diagnosis from the uh, 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 you know um, my hip pain uh, when I went to the ER here. Um, he's not you know gonna say uh, uh, anything about summarizing my physical therapy for any of my my hip pains. I've never got my you know um, deposition transcript uh, that he got from December fifth. Uh, 2017. Um, he read this deposition. However, he won't summarize it. Yeah, because it's probably too damaging to all their cases. That that's why they won't even give it to me. And my court date's next week, and it's almost been damn four years. Uh, there are volumes of records, or three years, uh, more than three years, three and a half years, almost four years. Yeah, I mean, you know, it's going on. It is. Uh, there are volumes of records from Swedish Medical going back from. You know, um, he reviewed the records. Only he's going to briefly summarize in from 2012. Uh, value for low back pain because I was, you know, uh, working emptying fish tanks. It wasn't emptying fish tanks. It was like a five-gallon bucket that I was, you know, emptying for my mom. This had four gallons in it, and I just kind of bent over, you know, to dump it wrong, and it just kind of hurt. Um, it was sore, uh, you know. Uh, evaluated um, uh, regarding motorcycle vehicle accident in five sixteen fourteen 14 that occurred three days ago. Yeah, I went to the ER for that one too, and I went to the ER for the other two uh, accidents, and it really, you know, it just costed these insurance companies money, and I always had the same effects. It's not like I was, you know, you had a, you know, bleeding out every orifice and needed to go to the emergency room and have massive amounts of tests done because... You know, these people, I'm just used to these people hitting me, and I'm used to just getting bodies like that when I hit the gym. Um, but uh, evaluating physician's notes that he had neck and back pain, but they never evaluate the physician's notes that he says he worked out in the gym, and he's never going to tap out, and he's going to get the one that he wants, uh, you know, of his dreams, and, and, and uh, would, you know, we're going to have a good life together. Uh, it's a recent car accident. Pain appears to be, uh, you know, in his back and neck, uh, you know, uh, and hey, whatever uh, physician does not think he needs emergency imaging. Yeah, it's like no brainer. Uh, and the patient states that he just came to the emergency room, so he was referred to the uh, insurance claim adjuster. This time treatment wasn't uh, necessary. Yeah, I must have you know talked to him. Whatever. Uh, Six fifteen fourteen. Next visit, Mister is valued for abdominal pain. Yeah, I got sick with my uh, uh, gastroenteritis, uh, irritable bowel syndrome. Upon referring from Tanya Bryant. Uh, Victor Latorto is evaluated by physical therapy department um, regarding his lower back pain, and that was uh, 923 to 214. And that wasn't for lower back pain, that was actually for my right hip pain, okay, I believe. Um, and so this guy is actually wrong. The, she, he sent me to, she, uh, you know, I got sent to PT for my right hip from um, the 14 accident. Uh, my left, uh, you know, hip wasn't till the other accident, and so. He's trying to say that I had, you know, I went to physical therapy regarding right lower back pain. That's so wrong. He has a history. Uh, uh, check the physical therapy notes. He has a history of motor vehicle accidents. Uh, even Dennis was the one who helped me on this one. And he helped me come out to my Altima and change the uh, adjustment seat in my car. And you can even ask him about it. He'll tell you. Uh, that's how he fixed it. Um, uh, you know, um, the, some of the pressure that was being put on my right uh, hip. And uh, uh, he has a history of uh, uh, minor motor vehicle accidents. And uh, it's because I drive so much. He's involved in motor vehicle accidents because dork nuts like these always just run into me. Uh, you know, he states when he usually gets in a motor vehicle accident, he goes to a chiropractor and massage therapist. Yeah, it's a no brainer. It's just how I work that. For so many years, you know, the body rebuilds itself if you eat right and take care of yourself. Uh, uh, you know, that's why I put my wife through massage school so I could keep the balance of life. He exists, you know, um, you know, it, it is noted he is muscular. Yeah, of course he's freaking not a freaking chimpanzee. Come on, guys. Uh, Mr. Latoro states he does not work out much. Like, when did I state out that? Like, I, I don't work out much at times. At times, like when people smash into me and, and then I have to go to the doctors and get chiropractic and massage therapy. Yeah, I don't work out at those times, but there are times when I feel better and I have to, and I do get my act together and I do get to work out. So these guys are just putting a mixed bag of just bullshit here that they're not even telling the real story. It's noted uh, he is muscular and just unreal. I don't see any additional physical therapy visits. Yeah, because I didn't need any because you're a dork nut for that accident. It, it might have been for my back too and that stuff you know all related to my hit and dork nut and that was my right side and the second accident was my left so victor latour is going to soreness in his penis yeah 
Really? And it's mildly tender? Yeah, what? Really? From her or something? I don't get what, you know, he's trying to get. Because this is from an accident, not like anything to do with my honeymoon. All right? Um, complaints of an earache? Yeah. Because uh, I was uh, working out in the gym, swimming, trying to get better in the hot tub, you know, taking uh, baths. And uh, I got swimmers, swimmers here, you know, from, from all the working out. And, you know, I'm just used to it. So, I, you know, I go to the doctors and it's no big deal for me. But these people want to make it a big deal. Like I got some kind of freaking long-standing history of like, you know, mental illness. Like it's freaking, it's just swimmer here, guys. Come on. He finished a course of antibiotics. It's like big deal, you know. Uh, uh, he currently has severe pain in his left ear. He's examined. Uh, uh, nose extremities are trying to make no evidence of infection. Well, what? They just gave me severe antibiotics because I didn't have an infection. I mean, come on, guys. Who made it this shit up? There is serious otitis assessment in his left earache. Like, come on. I just, you know, I, I get earaches from, from, I just, they just, they just doctored this up to make it look like they're just, uh, you know, they're right. And I'm just having earaches for whatever, you know, no, not even an infection. I just get earaches for absolutely no reason at all, I guess. Cause I, you know, I look like that. That's why I get earaches. Uh, evaluated regarding initial assessment for restraint or seclusion. Yeah, they put me in the hospital because I, you know, was thinking for too many days straight about all the crooked corruption and frauds that I've been in, involved in and how the Mandela effect had just kind of happened and taken down, you know, and, and I was just, you know, realistically, uh, you know, learning about all this stuff of what happened in 2012. And, uh, uh, you know, he presented the emergency room psychotic behavior. What, because I telling you guys about the truth about what happened to me? And just how much data I was crunching. Yeah, of course he's not going to summarize all of all the conspiracies that it went down uh, in my computer. Because he really can't even open his mouth because he's a dork nut. Evaluate an outpatient physical therapy. Uh, you know, uh, 5, 5, 2015. Uh, uh, after, you know, um, the second accident. Um, so, uh, uh, motor, you know, involved in another motor vehicle accident in January. And referred to the doctor. Uh, uh uh, Tanya Bryant, MD. Who is who? Who is he referred by? I mean, fucking, what are you talking about? I just went to the doctor because I didn't want to go to the hospital and rack up some stupid bill that I knew they were gonna f probably end up not paying for or is gonna take out of my settlement. I was trying to be Mister Nice Guy and and just go to the doctor, not create some monster headache for myself. I just wanted massage therapy and chiropractic and and and, and I just wanted to get better. Look like that, and you know, it evaluated whatever. These people are just. You know, I just, uh, you know, that was physical therapy. And that's when I started physical therapy because just a couple months later after the accident, because my hip got messed up four months later, it was like, boom, like, like the tear got worse. And all of a sudden my hip was inflamed the tear from like the first, you know, right when the accident happened and I called them and told them about it. They still haven't released the tape. Uh, the therapist tries to help me. Yeah, she, she, she did a, a pretty good job. She gave me uh, the roller over there. Um, you know, I, I, I do good with the roller still and, and it's really great that physical therapy, you know, we completed it and um, He has improvement with working, but he uh, continues to have a left anterior hip pain. Yeah, it was still a, seriously It wouldn't go away. It got you know a little bit tamed where I could walk and stuff uh, It just kept locking up uh, and causing me pain evaluated by a physical therapist Physical therapist. so I you know, then I went to see Dennis a different physical therapist to discharge summary is complete total of four times uh, states he can continue with his exercise program on his own, uh, undergoes another cool physical therapy due to the same, it says low back, neck pain, and sprain. No, uh, a physical therapy evaluation was due to my freaking hip. Like, what are they talking about, you know? Uh, it was my hip. We were, you know, doing the, the, the ultrasound on and all the stuff on, left hip, okay? Second accident, uh, record record of another physical therapy session on this date so i had a bunch of physical therapy uh i went to the uh, emergency room with eye pain yesterday is walking in the yard no i was working in the yard who walks in the yard and accidentally gets poked in the eye with the tree branch maybe some idiots who don't look where they're going but i'm not an idiot i was you know um doing a little maintenance on one of my bushes outside uh and uh, uh i was put my head in between two emeralds and, and and to you know clear out the brush in between and the uh, uh just i got poked in the eye um uh, again evaluated by a physical they just don't want to say that i'm working out in the yard to get buffed out like that um so they just try to make it look like it's walking in the yard uh i don't know these uh, again evaluated by a physical therapist uh, uh, IT, uh, van, blood, ever. There are records of more physical therapy, March and April. And, you know, I just kept having this pain. It's still kind of in my lip. I mean, it's always there. I always just take care of it myself. Now it's not so bad. I have to go back. Um, 
I would, you know, need more, uh, 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 you know, a little bit more treatment for massage and chiropractic and maybe possibly physical therapy to always, uh, to get better. I mean, I'm not completely 100% better. I, you know, I probably could do that again, though. I'm in the gym and with a little therapy myself, with a little massage and chiro. Uh, ninth physical therapy session, blah, blah, blah. Record from Stevens Hospital indicates that Mr. Tordo is evaluated in neck pain. He was in a motor vehicle accident in 09, and then 2000, uh, uh, you know, t uh, 11, or yeah, 2011, he was, uh, you know, uh, chief complaint. He was involved in another motor vehicle accident at Swedish Hospital um, that occurred yesterday on 1 11, and that's, you know, uh, uh, 1 and then we got um, Bordecai at September 13th, so you got. You know, eight months, that's me in eight months later. You know, I'm looking good, I'm feeling good. Uh, chief complaint um, yesterday, uh, uh, you know, and then I'm working out, going to the gym, feeling great. And then I was, you know, um, uh, uh, here's, he gives he gives uh, the uh, records from the uh, massage therapist uh, from 2011, from when I was looking like that, and it gives all the, the uh, uh, treatment dates or whatever. You know, I said he's uh, seen these times, and well, the chart notes indicate whatever uh, uh moderate plus left shoulder back pain bilateral low back pain treatment weekly massages and they reignited the fire in my left side of my neck you know it's muscular 2000 trip to the philippines fixed it uh uh and then these other you know people the dylan accident fucking reignited again um uh uh, uh, uh last visit and grouping uh uh plan is to continue with weekly massages and uh uh the uh, uh moderate left shoulder pain too when i go to the gym and work out um uh uh my 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 uh my my shoulders was was always sure but i i still got around it see that uh you know i was always strong and i always worked worked it through um and uh it got better and it wasn't causing me any pain after that and uh, now it's causing me more pain too, um, plus bilateral low back pain. You know, I've always had little low back pain, but I always my treatment plan was always weekly massages. So I put my wife through massage school. I mean, it's a no brainer. Um, I've had this treatment plan for many, many years. This is nothing new for me. Uh, you know, my last visit in the grouping, blah blah blah, and then records. That that was just all the records of uh, you know before May thirteenth of twenty four. Now this is for my first, basically you know records of of uh. uh 524 that he wants to post of uh, I don't know why he's waiting so long but he returns to the massage therapist uh he was a motor vehicle collision on March 8th of 2014 um um uh he complains of uh pain in his neck mid back and low back uh uh and low back right greater than left and he is unable to do his daily work so he forgot to mention my right hip pain, um, and going to the, uh, 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 the, um, Swedish hospital and seeing Dennis, the physical therapist, uh, um, for that, um, chart notes indicate that Victor was seen, uh, each two times in May, uh, 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 four times in blah, 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 uh, 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 chart notes, uh, he was seen, you know, each one and three times and twice and, and, and wherever, uh, uh, maybe she was just talking about uh, the massage therapist all here, I guess. And uh, post records after uh, the 2015, or, or after January 5 of 2015, which uh, is my second Verdine accident, uh, uh, returned to the massage therapist. And basically, you know, he had all these issues here. Uh, billing records are there because I paid for it all myself. And here is the opinion, the opinions expressed in this report are based upon a more probable than not basis. Uh, what injuries, if any, did plaintiff sustain as a result of each accident? I'll start a new video on the next one.